Hi friends, this is Jarvis and I'm back relaxing on this chair and today we're going to have another review. Uh, just to start off with, I always tell people that I don't just do high-end guitars, I also do entry-level guitars. And uh, right now this is a special uh, entry uh, guitar that just came in and if you look at the special headstock, beautiful headstock uh, with the uh, black color tuners uh, from the this company called LAG LAC LAC Messi Buco Mac is LAC is made in France but this uh, piece uh, is a dreadnought called a Tremontaint T R A M O N T A N E is a T one hundred D dreadnought guitar. Uh, this is I think licensed and made in in China. But uh, don't let that China name fool you because when I took one strum of this guitar, even before I fitted the new saddle, new FMI saddle, all this, I was shocked and surprised. And when I took a total, uh, a closer look at the guitar, everything on this guitar is about wood. There's no plastic binding, there's no, nothing about this that is plastic on this guitar. Let me just go through this uh, LAC uh, guitar. The top spots a uh, cedar top guitar. Cedar tops, cedar top so gives you a more uh, a deeper bass, a more open sounding uh, guitar with the nice rounded and a clear trebles, bell like trebles on this on this uh, guitar. Later when you hear it, uh, this spots a X brace with normal X brace with the tone brass at the scallop, and uh, the bridge is uh, interesting design because the design of this bridge. It's a pinless bridge, and I'm going to go closer a little bit to you, to let you have a look a little bit of of the bridge itself. The bridge is a uh, nicely designed pinless bridge, okay, and it's made of uh, Indian rosewood. Uh, but when I took the uh, the back, uh, uh, what you say, the a mirror to see inside, the there are two inlays that is you can't really see here. Uh, there are actually screws and nuts that are beneath this uh, this uh, guitar itself, and uh, you can really uh, I guess it's for stability sake. I don't, normally don't see that uh, them on the high end guitars. Um, the binding on this guitar is basically what looks like mahogany to me. The back and sides are mahogany. I was told that this back and sides are made of mahogany that is laminated, so the back and sides are laminated. Um, the bindings are, are wood, but if you look at this carefully at the sides, the there is also uh, uh, purfling lines on the back and the sides. And if you look closely at the even the neck joint, beautifully done. Look at this inlaid with the the back black perf uh, purfling lines, maple black, white black purfling lines on this this guitar itself. How does this guitar sound? Um, this guitar really sound really loud. Uh, okay, another thing about the rosette itself, you can see the design of the rosette itself is all wood with this special the inlay that's inside here on this guitar itself. Pretty nice uh, uh, wood uh, rosette that's on this. The fretboard is uh, Indian rosewood and is bounded. The on um, it's a three piece neck, one piece here two piece here and then the third piece is up here how does this guitar sound yes now we'll just play it I was really a little bit surprised when I took the, the guitar and then give it one strum pretty sweet sounding let's do a light strumming okay Sustain is incredible, incredible. Yes, that's it. Because of C 
see that top you can't overdrive the top too much if you strum it too hard it's there's a seating where it just breaks off a little bit that's the limitation of the sitter top but when you play it lightly it responds lee couple the guitar a little bit So we have this uh, Lac Tremontaine guitar that is uh, right now in Singapore. This was brought in uh, from directly from Australia. I'm sure there's no distributor right now in Singapore, but maybe after if the dealers here listen to and watch this video and this review, probably they may just want to take up the dealership for Singapore and we'll soon have uh, Lac guitars in Singapore. 
which I think they are good sounding guitars and well made. This one, the neck set is perfect. I couldn't find a flaw in the, the way the neck is pitched on this guitar. Maybe because it came from Australia, the weather was just right and, and everything was just perfect on this guitar. Um, reasonably priced, 400 Aussie dollars. Maybe if it comes to Singapore, it's cheaper than that. Um, not, Beautiful sounding guitar, beautiful looking one, nice bridge design. Let me go through the head stock. There's no inlays on the uh, fretboard itself. Uh, it's bounded also. Wood binding. Uh, Magony back inside that is laminated as well as stained. Wood binding. Nice uh, neck heel design. Everything about this guitar is uh, pretty nice. So there you have it, the uh, LAC guitar, LAG, LAC guitar, uh, I will call this probably an entry level, uh, that is made in China, under license, and uh, I'm going to sign off soon, uh, this is my review for the LAC guitar, if you like all, any of my, my reviews and you want some comments and you want to make some suggestions, uh, you can either post it just below, positive, positive comments, post it below or you can email me at uh, my personal email guitarsaddle at hotmail.com g-u-i-t-a-r-s-a-d-d-l-e uh, my name is Jarvis and I say live with passion and play your guitar yes till my next review I'm going to say sign off bye bye <laughs>